Good morning, guys. Waking up in our hotel room in Sacramento, and this is our view. It's pretty nice. Definitely feel bad for that IMAX theater, though. Probably no one's been using it for a long time. This morning, we're getting tight already. We are. Huh? We. <laughs> your mom bear is getting him ready. Ooh, I like your outfit. That's a cool shirt. Oh, what's up? You kissed me and you fell? Yeah. This guy's been wanting to wear shorts all day. Yeah, he keeps lifting up his pants. He Come loves on. shorts, huh? I'll fix your shirt too, yeah. But it's cold in Sacramento. No. Don't put it on the bed. Hey, that's yucky. Did you like the park you played at yesterday? Yeah, did we well? That's, that's fun, huh? Bombs away! Come on, bombs away. That's why I'm shoes. That's got. Go sit. Never could be done. Nothing In can be. Fashion. Yeah. This guy got too much style. Wait, hey, hey, hey! Look at that. You sink it into quicksand. Monkey, I gotta put your shoes on. <laughs> Stop, stop, stop. This guy likes to have fun, huh? Yes, yeah, stop. Taika, you like to have fun, huh? Here. Like the pop. Taika, one. But you have to listen. You gotta listen to your mama, okay? You gotta listen to your mama. You can't yeah. have fun all the time. Yeah, it's in my bushies. It's at home. We'll get your bushy today. Yeah, we're going back home today. I'm actually very proud of you, Taika. You know that? He doesn't really care for it. Cause he, he slept without his bushy. We all know how much he needs his bushy, and we forgot it. But uh, he actually slept. Without I like that presentation. We that's really know how much you need. And we forgot. We it. did, I know. I, messed up. I know, but you left. I gotta tie your shoes. Oh my god. Alright, so a lot of people don't know this, but Silent Micah is a Sacramento historian. PhD. <laughs> yeah. And so Doctor. Did you call this... me Doctor? Dr. Mike, yeah. Dr. Silent, yeah. is we're at Historic District yeah. in Sacramento. Tell me about this place. Yeah, it's crazy. A lot's gone down here over the years. Like the first alien sighting was over Whoa, here on the corner. Really? Yep, yep, in 1915. Whoa, alien! Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I don't actually know what the Historic District is. Yeah, really? No, I don't. It's not like old beers or like I old... I don't know. I know our city's like was the end of kind of like the, uh, what is it, Lewis and Clark moving west? Deal, you know? Like oh, really? What? Maybe not them in particular. Like but the pioneers. The pioneers. So yeah. John Sutter's one. There's a, his fort's still here. If you dude, want. you do know about history, you nerd. A little bit. I went to a weird <laughs> school, you know. Yeah. You so, have to learn about Sacramento. Yeah, yeah, and we have like we have a fort. Like you'll drive down the road and then you yeah. look to your left and it looks like a like a colony fort is just Whoa. sitting there. Um, but I don't know what this is. But the buildings are cool. Yeah, I like. I always like these because it's so rare. Like in uh. In LA, we have a ton of these old buildings that they refurbish or repurpose and it looks tight. Yeah, yeah that's like this one. This one's just brand new, re uh, refurbed. Yeah. So it looks sick inside. Yeah, I love it. But I don't know. I don't know what the historic, but it's a big strip now. It's like five blocks and it's kind of one of our main like food bar strips. It's our street. Oh, I see. All right, I'm about to get some breakfast at this street. place called Fox and Goose. So we just checked in at the breakfast spot, but it's popping because it's supposed to be really yummy. As you can see, there's a lot of people out front. So we're gonna go check out Santa Mike's gym in the meantime, because it's like a 40 minute wait. The food looks pretty good. Whoa, modeling time? Hit, hit the pose, another pose. Now Silent Mike's new gym in Sacramento. Not really new, huh? It's been around yeah. for like a year now. It's just COVID times. Yeah, I got the keys in June. Woo. But we're officially open, yeah, like October. That's awesome. So if you guys like what you see in and out in Sacramento, for sure come out here. Mike super legit. He's deadlifted 700 pounds. He'll help you get strong. And oh, I like your front desk. That's nice. Nice. Oh, dance place is big, dude. Hey, that's the football you got. That's the football song I got you. This is dope. Hell yeah. Hammer strength machines. That's dope. Oh, I love these machines. These are great for bodybuilding. Whole dumbbell section. Nice. Belt squat. Cable. This is by Sorinex? Yeah. They make good stuff, huh? Yeah, they really do. That's sick. Right. The effects we got over here. We got a powerlifting section. Deadlift platforms. We got squat racks. Oh, I love these plates. These are my favorite. Except they're too expensive, so we didn't get them for barbell, but... 
they're my favorite because it's easy to grab, you know? Ivankos. Nice. Damn, look at all these platforms. Oh, and a nice little like cardio section. This is cool, huh? Yeah, so if you're out in Sacramento looking for a sick ass strength gym to train at, this place is dope. For sure, come out here. I love the rustic feel. Got a big old squat rack over there. Tons of, or one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. If you're running out of squat racks at your gym, there's eight of them here. Competition benches, bodybuilding section. What more do you need? Bathrooms? This place looks dope. So this place looks really cool. How did you design it? Was it already like this exposed truss system or? So the exposed wood was there. Yeah. And then uh, Nads has seen some of the, like coffee shops and bars here in town. And yeah. even you just looking inside of uh, Fox and Goose for a second. Yeah. There's kind of like a, like a industrial vibe to yeah. a lot of our food. Yeah, I love that. And so I was like, how do we put that in like a fitness space? Yeah. So we already had the, the exposed. Yeah. But the rest of this place, like this was regular. This used to be a machine shop in the 70s. Yeah. So you could literally like see oil still. Oh wow. It was wild. And then like So you finished the floor yourself? I did it. I grinded this whole thing wow. with a ten inch blade. Whoa. It took me like three days of Damn. straight work. Just wow. it was insane. Uh, so we dyed it, painted it. Um, and then my business partner Jimmy D it, You want a football? Yeah. <laughs> uh, we just kind of had that vision because he's yeah. from here too. Yeah. And it was just like, how do we bring a little bit of Sacramento into the fitness space, which I don't think has been done. And how do we make something in the fitness space that doesn't look like other spots? Other spots, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, it looks really artistic too. <laughs> yeah, so we just had literally, it, and that's probably the thing I'm most proud of is we had an idea and we actually like executed on it really well. Yeah, sick design. Yeah, so all the woodwork Jim did, all the, the framed work, that yeah. wasn't here, Jim did all that. Okay. Um, the metal work, that's just a wall, we did all that. Yeah. The front desk, we built it by hand. That's cool. Yeah, like everything just piece by piece, piece by piece, trying to see like, oh, does that look the trash cans? Like we try to find fucking trash yeah, cans. Yeah, barrels. Yeah, yeah. they're, so. they're, they're uh, uh, they make like uh, apple, cider, uh, apple cider vinegar out of those. What? And we bought them used from like this dude. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, and so like they're all like kind of industrial. Yeah, yeah, so. yeah, no, I like it. Yeah, piece by piece. Turned out awesome, proud Thanks, of you, man. dude. Thanks, buddy. All right, this is a crazy game changer. They have showers here. So I'm a owner of a mom and, mom, mom and pop gym myself and I've been into many of them across the nation and it is so hard to get showers into the gym. One, just because you don't have that much space when you're a mom and pop gym owner and two, a lot of it has to deal with city zoning. The fact that they have this is amazing. So like if you guys are looking for a place to pop in, get in a workout, and also get clean on your way out and not have to take these hose ass showers that I do at the back of Barbell every day. Dude, this place is awesome. What do you want to eat for our breakfast? I want, <laughs> I want chocolate chip pancakes. Chocolate chip pancakes? Yeah. What about blueberry pancakes? No, um, chip what about waffles? No, I want chocolate chip pancakes. What about French toast? No chocolate chip pancakes! Hey, hey, hey. Whoa, hey, whoa, hey, whoa, hey, chill, chill, dude. whoa. <laughs> that guy was going crazy. Alright, so let's see what I'm gonna get. They got a lot of good food. Smoked salmon plate, that thing's kind of calling my name. Served with capers, tomatoes, tomatoes, onions, homemade scone minis, omelette. Let's see, the full Monty? Benedict Arnold? Mmm, traditional grilled sirloin steak. What are you gonna get, Mike? I don't know. It's healthy nice. or not healthy? Yeah, that's that's. Are the you question. on a diet or are you not on a diet? Look, you look good, dude. You look good with weight, actually. Thanks, man. Yeah, you actually look good with weight. Okay, you don't have to lie. He's saying I'm a cute fat guy. That's basically what he just said. I'm a cute fat guy. I don't you did. Like that. You did say that. I heard it. So usually I always get the steak and eggs, which is what Mama got. But since this place looks like a like a legit breakfast place, like look at the beans, corned beef hash. Oh my god. If I tried something fancy, this is their Athena egg uh, egg white omelette. And I added smoked salmon in there. So let's see how this looks. It tastes. Oh, it looks. Ooh, nice. Let's see. Oh, I got too big of a piece. Mmm, the hot. Driving around, Mike giving us a little tour of the state capital. Oh man, it's hilarious. 
they're recalling the governor <laughs> right in front of the Capitol? With a rock concert. That's freaking crazy. So where's the, oh, is that it? That's it. Yes. Hey, Taika, look. Yeah, pull over. Yeah. Taika, look, you're at the Capitol. Look, Taika. Isn't that cool? Here. Yeah, yeah. The police car. <laughs> awesome. I doesn't care. Well, now you can tell people you've been to the Capitol and we have the proof, okay? Yes, we got proof. All right, doesn't care. Let's get ice cream. Where's the best ice cream at? <laughs> Devil May Care, dude. Sponsor us. All right. We need it. Let's go. <laughs> Tiger's so excited for ice cream. Ice cream, ice cream. Yummy, ice yummy ice, ice cream. cream. <laughs> How come it looks so much more ridiculous than an adult does it? Ice cream. Devil may care. Okay, right. Mike, you're saying this is literally the best I, ice cream on the know, planet? You know I know ice cream. You do, right? you're I'm right. fat. Yeah. I've eaten a lot of ice cream. Okay. And this is definitely in the top three ice creams I've ever had. Top three? Top three. Oh shoot. Alright. But the one thing is they do like hipster stuff. Yeah. So it'll give you like a lavender charcoal. I like those bark ones. dust. I like those. You like a bark dust lavender? Well, I like pistachio. Pistachio's not as this hipster. Is what? This or salt and salt. Really? Ooh, ooh. It's Shots fired stuff. salt and straw. Ooh. Love it. Do you see what you like, mister? Is that like a mango? Uh, yeah, the manganata. Ooh, manganata. Mango. 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 What's your favorite one? Uh, right now, my favorite is the miso okay. cherry. Which one's miso cherry? That one? Miso cherry. Miso cherry. That's, that's crazy. <laughs> that is crazy. I got it. Ooh. Damn, those are good flavors. Cornflake, dude. Which one are you gonna get? Probably cornflake. Cornflake with my lucky charms. Huh? Maybe one of each. Oh. You're going miso? I have to get that. Someone's gotta try it. I gotta get that for sure. <laughs> I gotta get two. Is crunch berries a cereal? Yeah. I don't even know. It has to be. Oh, yeah. Apple cinnamon, apple, cinnamon Cheerios. That's yeah. what Dude. I know. Which ice cream did you get? That looks yummy. Is it yummy? <laughs> this guy's going crazy. Oh. Why are you moaning? After this, I don't think I need a wife. What did you get? For real? I got... Maybe uh, I should have got one of these instead of a wife too. <laughs> yeah, definitely you chose the wrong one. <laughs> you should... Which one I is got this? sea salt. Yeah. Cookies and cream. I got something. that one too, yeah. So good. And you said that one. So that's the one who was... No, no. He was, the sea salt cookies what and cream the is the fuck? one he, he was moaning on. Yeah, eat the I moaning. I don't want to do what he's moaning about. <laughs> Oh, yeah. oh. <laughs> oh. Is it the That's best fun. ice cream? It's really good. The texture oh, shoot. is so good. It's dude. really good. The, it kind of, the vanilla kind of tastes like cereal oh, milk. No, oh, dude, it's so good. Try a lot of. Can I try yours? Oh. Really texture. Wow, yours texture, is really yeah. good too. So this one yeah. is miso, miso berry. Taika's is bomb. <laughs> No? No, that's good. Oh. I think you'll love the miso berry with one too. Oh, oh, oh. This is really good ice cream. The texture's insane. Wow. It kind of tastes like butter. Buttered, uh, so toast butter with butter jam. and jam. That's kind of what it tastes like. Texture Strawberry jam. Like mm-hmm. It's insane. How about yours? What did you get? <laughs> it just shows you. Do you like it? Imagine Yummy. doing a food show. Tell me, ask me about the ice cream. So, what do you like about the ice cream? <laughs> Damn. Well, how's yours? It's good. Oh. Why well, you always gotta be a rebel? Why I you know that was a rebel move. I was really because I was craving this drink. Because if I ate that, I'd just be walking. Yesterday, and you're not even drinking yesterday it. Yesterday went to a steakhouse, this, right? Oh. Yeah. He got chicken. And then it's no, this is what he said. <laughs> he oh my like, god, that was like, so he's funny. Like, hey, I looked at the pictures. No one get the steak. It I didn't say it like it that. It doesn't look good. He says, I bet you they're gonna mess up the steak. We should get the prime rib. I'm like, all right, cool. I didn't say that. He get the prime rib. I got the prime rib. He goes, can I get the porterhouse? No, he says. He said. He messed it up. Bart messed it up. So he said, he was like, oh man, don't get the steak here because they're for sure gonna mess it up. And then he looked at the pictures and then he goes. Look, and he shows me the picture of how fucked up it's gonna be, and then the Wasn't waiters here, and he ordered the fucking steak. He ordered the steak. You I didn't, ordered I didn't the say steak. don't order it. That's gatekeeping, keeping you guys out of the deliciousness. Yeah. I mean, it wasn't good. Really? He called it too. I don't like prime rib either. Prime rib guy. I mean, they had other shit. They had sandwiches, steak sandwiches, fish and, fish steak and chips, burger. 
That was cold. Last place was hot. Okay. Yummy. That's California, huh? Yeah. Is it our lucky day or what? So the nice lady in there told us that they had to take Instagram pictures for the okay, social on, media. Here, and then they're like, they can't eat all the ice cream. So they brought out extra ice cream Here. and it looks delicious. Oh, it's the Rice Krispie Tree with the chunky marshmallows. Game over, boys. Ooh, um, thank you so much. Hey, like Yay, monkey. Want, what horse do you want? This one right here. Good job, monkey. Are you ready? Ready to have the time of your life? Yeah. See you later. this candy whoa whoa look at all this candy that's crazy sour laces i have a feeling we're in candy heaven this guy's in candy heaven are you just grabbing a little bit of everything she's getting like a nasty candy she just never wants candy oh yeah true smart yeah it doesn't work like that no you had nasty if he candy. has if he has my jeans we you make like it the... we make it work so in this area called Old Sack, it's like a western style little cool village of like the gold rush era, western era of California. And now we're on, what is this, the river? Sacramento River? Or American? American I think it's just Sacramento. Well, it's beautiful. The American's on the other side. This is fresh water, right? What does that mean, dude? Like, like no salt? Yeah, yeah, no salt, yeah. This comes down from maybe Tahoe. Oh, nice. Yeah. Right down to San Francisco. You can ride this thing down to San Francisco. You sound like a 49er. Take this thing down, left downtown, the hook by the borough. End up riding the 49er Stadium. The stadium? Yeah. I thought we were in a period piece. Oh. I like to mix my... <laughs> I like to mix the model. Ride video. this horse all the way down to the Apple store. <laughs> Grab you an iPhone Apple Watch. <laughs> hop on the buggy. Grab a stogie. People really do though, I think. I think they ride this thing down and you can go watch the Giants game. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. That's really cool. Just to literally dump you in there. Hey, you wanna go swimming? Finally just got home. As you can see, got some McDonald's. Um, it is 10.05. Better go to sleep soon because I gotta wake up at 5 a.m. to train. So, uh, I'm uh, end the vlog here and i'll see you guys tomorrow but first home sweet home <sighs> feels good to be home Taika, where are you you're not in a good mood no. you fell asleep in the car tell everyone good night no. <laughs> are right, you tell everyone good night <laughs>